some more root beer. I guess they did like it at the location because I've been buying it ever since. Yo, what is good everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video today. As I can see, I am back at Sam's. Cause like you guys know, we gotta keep the hustle going. We gotta go out and collect money from actually just one location today. But yeah, basically we're gonna be going to two locations. I'm only restocking the first one, but in the second one, I do have to install the credit card machine. Basically so far, I don't actually need a lot of things today from Sam's. I just have root beer, I got Coke, I got one box of chips, some candy, and some peanut m ms And that's pretty much all we need. So let's go pay. Well actually, look, check this out. What I barely noticed is that I can pay as I go. So as I'm picking everything up, I get pay for it for example so okay i got the little barcode thing out now let me scan the m ms okay got it it shows it up there now again if i want to scan just click on it again sour patch see okay there you go got the sour patch and that way i don't have to go through like the register and just waste a whole bunch of extra time there you go i got everything so now at the end all i gotta do is click at the top where it says checkout so now that it has everything i just slide to pay okay give it a second and it should give me a barcode okay yeah there we go guys check this out i guess m ms came out with a new like product or chocolate bar what do you guys think should i put this in one of my locations and see how it sells let's check this out so i don't know exactly what it is i think it's just like a chocolate bar with m ms and side and they're pretty big actually so i don't know how much i would sell them okay never mind because actually they're about one dollar and forty cents because if i did i would have to sell them for like at least two dollars to make some money so what do you guys think would people buy them should i buy them to put them on the vending machine i don't even know if it will fit just because they're pretty big but i don't know i'll see maybe next time I'm actually using a crate this time for snacks just because I didn't have any more empty chip boxes but I mean it's doing pretty well so far there's the credit card machines which I will be installing today also you guys know that I don't normally sell peanut butter crackers but this time I'm actually gonna be putting them in the these crackers are the ones that I got from the vending machine where me and my brother went to. We bought everything from a random snack machine. It was pretty cool. I spent a lot of money. But yeah, I got these from that machine. I want to make my money back, basically. So hopefully I can put them in and they sell because last time I used to sell these, by the way. And they always want to expire just because nobody likes healthy stuff over here in Texas. Nobody, nobody is healthy. All right, what's up, you guys? So we just made it to the first location. I'm actually not restocking the machines on this location. I'm only going to be... Well, actually, I am going to refill the soda machine because it, it is completely out of Coke and root beer. So that's why you guys saw me at Sam's. I got root beer and I got more coke. That's pretty much the only thing I have to refill. And once I do that, I will be installing this credit card machine on the soda machine in the back. I really don't think I'll be able to record once I go back there just because there's always like a ton of people in the back. Uh, but now that I think about it, I don't know if I brought my dolly. Let me see if I have it. Let me check the back. I hope I have it just because I don't remember bringing it, but okay, yes, it's right here. Now that I think about it, why did I put all the drinks at the very bottom? Now I have to take all that down. Okay, get the root beer. By the way, how many of you guys like root beer? Just because if you guys remember, I used to not sell root beer. Because I used to think that people won't buy it. <laughs> but guess what? It actually sells really good. So let me know down below how many of you guys like root beer. I'm just curious. No way. No way. Oh my god. So if you guys couldn't tell so far um, from the previous like two videos that I'm like the dumbest person alive, basically. I think it was like two videos ago where I tried to come to the same location to install the three credit card machines, but I didn't because I forgot the cables. So finally the day I come back to this location, I forgot the keys to the vending machine. But like the worst part is that it's not just the keys to this location. It's the keys to also the other location I was going to to restock those machines. And again, the worst part is that I live one hour away. It's not like I can just go down the street, go pick up the keys and come right back. You know, I live far. So we finally made it back. I do have the keys this time. I got the keys. Okay, so part two again of doing this. Oh, that's so sketch. Oh my God, guess what I forgot now. <laughs> I'm just playing. I got everything I need. Let's go inside. Yeah. 
Some days are my worst days, but every day is a work day. I fell in love with the wordplay. If it's a dream, then you're never really working. And now the tides are turning. And as I keep on learning, I only do what's worth it. Don't waste my time because I earned it. Never got rid of the thirst. So much it hurts. Listen to my words. Everyone's the worst. That's why I immerse in my own universe. And I know it's a curse. Probably put me in a hearse. But I still write a verse. Maybe time will reverse. If I put in the work while everything hurts. Take a chance. Make a plan. You can do it. Yes, you can. Take a stand in your land. And command your brand off. The things we keep inside. I know I'll be alright. I'll fight with will and time. I won't lose my mind. So they told me that the machine was not taking any change and it's because somebody put another dime inside. Which if you guys look at the front of the machine, there is a huge sign that says no dimes and somebody still put a dime. All right everyone, so real quick, we just made it to the next location and this time I'm only restocking snacks. So I do have all these snacks in this little crate and I do have to take the box of chips also as well. This is my best location, but actually this time, believe it or not, I'm not restocking the soda machine. Cause last time I came, I filled up the soda machine literally to like the very top, every single slot. That way this time I didn't have to bring any drinks which saved me a lot of time also last time i came i'm pretty sure i didn't collect the money so if i didn't i will collect the money this time because i was gonna wait a whole month but i mean it is a collection video you know so i'll collect the money that way you guys can see how much i made this time and yeah let's go inside and see what we got Oh, I almost forgot. I do have to open up all this that I bought at Sam's and put it inside the crate just because, you know, these are the things that I was missing. Rice Krispies actually sell really, really good in this location. So I do have to put a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. As I can see, we have a lot of things missing. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight slots empty. This one's almost empty. I got a Cheeto stuck in there the other day. Oh, you got a bag of Cheetos stuck in there? Yeah. Coke is still pretty good. Dr. Pepper's good. Diet Coke is a little bit empty, but it's still good for now. Monster's also pretty low, but it doesn't really sell, so it's good for now. So we are back and we have finally secured the box full of money. So I do have all the cash right over here. I got the bills, I got the coins, dimes, nickels. This is for two weeks because like I said, I didn't collect the money last time I came. But it is still a pretty good amount. That's all the bills, all the coins are still in there. Not too many coins this time, but you know, we got the bills, we got the coins. And don't forget, we still have the credit card machine. So I do have to add that at the end. I know you guys freak out every single time I put the money inside of a box like this. Because for those of you that don't know, I've done this before and I threw away the box full of money just because I thought it was trash. I do see a few comments from you guys saying that y'all get paranoid and like, you know, nervous thinking I'm gonna throw it away again. But this time I won't, I promise. I do keep it right next to me now. But yeah, once we get home, I'll let you guys know how much money we made. So let's go. All right, what's up you guys? So I just got back, as I can see, I'm counting up all the money that we just got from the location I just serviced. So this right here is 200, and I still have to count all of this. I do have gloves on this time, because every single time I count money, my hands smell like so disgusting. But yeah, I got the money from the location. And before I let you guys know how much it is, comment down below right now how much bills you think this is. I would say maybe 250, 280. I don't think it's more than 300 for sure. All right, so right here we have 100 so far, 57 and 58. So, so far we have 100, $258 in bills. In coins, we got a total of $36 with 75 cents. And in credit card sales for the last two weeks, we got a total of $167 with 25 cents. I normally do collect the money every seven days from that location because it is my busiest location. But you know, I wanted to wait two weeks to see how much it will come out to. But anyways, the grand total for everything was $462. I'm pretty excited, especially now that 
that summer is coming. You know, summer, it gets really busy. People start buying drinks, people start buying snacks. I right, what's up you guys, so real quick before I talk about the giveaway Two days ago I did go restock my vending machine at my barbershop location But I was actually not recording that day because I didn't have my camera and also I was in a rush But anyways I went to go restock the machine I opened up the bill acceptor and that thing was full Ever since I started my vending machine business I've never had a completely full bill acceptor But I actually did record it with my phone So real quick here's a clip Anyways, it is now time for the giveaway. And by the way, I'm sorry if I have like black stuff on my mouth. I ate some of the donuts that I sell. I know it's bad to eat the product, but I got hungry, so I'm sorry. But anyways, yes, there is another giveaway. And no, I'm not giving away another gumball machine. I already gave away two. I just shipped out the second one a couple days ago. Anyways, you guys might be wondering, then Jaime, what are you giving away this time? This time, I wanted there to be more than one winner. So there's gonna be 15 winners. So I will be giving away 15 Amazon gift cards. Five of them are $10 each. The other five are $15 each and then of course the last five are $30 each okay so let's go ahead and start with the $10 gift cards pretty much the only thing you guys have to do is go follow my Facebook page I will leave the link down below that is where I'm gonna be posting all the recent videos and basically pretty much everything I post on YouTube and that's pretty much it go follow the Facebook page I will be messaging five random people that like the page so now for the $15 gift cards of course there is five of them also this one's gonna be pretty exciting because what I did is I put those five codes all over this video so if you guys saw something before and you were like what the heck is that it is a code so go claim it real quick before anybody else does so now for the five thirty dollar gift cards these are actually the easiest ones pretty much the only thing you guys have to do is go down below and comment pretty much anything you guys want and then in 24 hours I will be picking five random people that comment but you guys have to make sure in 24 hours to come back to this video just because the last couple times I've done a giveaway I go back to the comment I reply to them and then I never get a message I never get a reply so I have to pick somebody else. So again, 24 hours, come back to the channel and see if you want. But yeah, good luck to everyone. But anyways, that's gonna be pretty much it for the video. I hope everyone did enjoy. If you did, drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already. I make some pretty dope videos, right baby? But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.